Hey, Happy New Year's to everyone. Today I'm going to be showing you a brand new rune farm glitch that you can do as of right now. You can do this early game and I'm sure there's going to be a few questions if you skip past this. Most of you are going to be like, how is this early game? I will be showing you how this can be done early game, yet for now this is going to be a different method. So wait it out a little bit longer and I will be explaining the method for you guys out there that are low level. What we are going to be picking up is a scepter that is located towards the end here, and I will be showing it on the map. This is at Crumbling Farum, or Farum, however you say it. I'm probably butchering it, but hey, it's a-okay. It's okay. Just continue onward. Now, as you make your way down, take your right, then exit out of this building and jump down. From here, there will be an invader that pops up. Once you do take him out, you should be rewarded with his armor as well as his scepter. So, we can then continue on to the next requirement, and this is going to be towards the end of the game. I am not going to spoil anything at all, so if you are worried about that, don't worry. I definitely did not include anything towards the boss and what it looks like and all that, so you're good to go on that. The only requirement is that you reach the end, and you then go inside the tree and beat the boss. Once that has been done, you will then be rewarded with the hammer, which is right here. After that has been done, you can then move on to the last requirement, which can be found over here at the Death Touched Catacombs. If you have watched yesterday's video, then you might be well aware of what we are going to be doing next. For those that are not, I will be explaining it here shortly. If you go towards the end here, take a left, then go down the stair steps, and then we are going to then jump off, do a 180, then go this way, go down the hallway, take a left, and as you do, on your guys' screen, there will be a katana right here. Pick that sucker up, and you now have the Uchi Katana. So, we now have all the three requirements, we are good to go. For those that did watch yesterday's video and said that it's not possible to do it early game, let me explain how it can be done. Once you have taken out Godfrey, or no, excuse me, not Godfrey, I believe it's Godric, once you have taken him out and you talk to this fella here, he will congratulate you and say a bunch of other stuff, then you can meet him over here at the Rose Church. You will talk to him, he will then ask you to invade someone three times, and you have successfully done so, he will then reward you with the medallion. If you decide to use the medallion, which you definitely should, this will teleport you to this location right here. You will then follow the stair steps up and you can claim the Lost Grace. This will be the Dynasty Mausoleum entrance. We are going to then exit out of there, go up the stair steps, then proceed up the next then, from here, we want to turn around and jump on top of the rocks. We are going to do the offhand swap glitch. So, this involves equipping the Uchi Katana in your left and the hammer in your right. We are going to then slash. As you slash down, hit the Ashes of War button right there and then pause. Go down and select the scepter, then push forward and sprint. If successfully done, you will be air walking in the sky or just pretty much midair, and you will then be able to use your mount on top of these rocks and then jump towards the next, and you will then be on the very top portion. What's so great about this spot is that when you jump down directly in the hole, just like previous videos, we are going to avoid this death by jumping down and swinging right away. This will allow you to survive the fall death animation. So yeah, if you stop swinging, you're done. You're capiche. But yeah, after 30 seconds, you will be rewarded with some runes as long as you do swing. Now, uh, what you want to do is open up the map and go back to the Lost Grace. Or if you do have the Golden Scarab equipped, this will give you more runes as well. And let's talk about early game. A lot of you were confused about the last video saying that it was not possible and as I've shown you can then talk to the white mask guy there at the start and then acquire the medallion which will teleport you here once you are here just go towards the left this is a fast method 
yet it's difficult that's why I showed a different method there towards the right side for this one all you have to do is jump towards the left and jump directly on top of this rock here towards the right then jump towards the left and land like so you can jump off the map swing constantly and you're good to go and with all that information to the side if you guys found the video helpful give it a thumbs up and I will see you all in the comment section and on the next video